A man in Marion makes a gruesome discovery while cleaning out his garage after a break-in. A man dead under a heavy antique safe. Police say the safe weighs more than 900 pounds. It's a story we've been following. Wayne 15's Ruben Solis joins us now with more on what we've learned. Ruben? Yeah, Dirk and Tara, the homeowner, George Hollingsworth, told me he'd been cleaning his garage for about an hour. He then went back to where the safe was and was shocked by what he found. He said, is my mind playing tricks on me? And I, I said, this can't be a body. But George was right. Underneath this 900-pound antique safe was a body. It still kind of uh, <laughs> messes with you because, like I say, you don't expect it. And you wouldn't expect something like that in a lifetime. On Tuesday, George reported to police he thought someone had broken into his garage and the door was kicked in. Because the place was packed with clutter, he started cleaning the next day to see if anything was stolen. While cleaning, he noticed his dad's antique floor safe toppled over. That's when he reached down to pick up a jacket and felt something strange. I picked it up and it, I said, man, it feels like a head. My wife had a big doll out there and I thought, that's that doll. He then noticed the man's legs. That's when he ran out to get his wife to tell her what was happening. I said, I think we got a dead body in the garage. She said, oh, you're kidding me. She said, oh, that's kidding her. And I said, no. George's wife called 911. When the officer arrived, he wasn't sure if the man was actually dead. I went over there and he said, hey, buddy, buddy. And then one day kind of tapped him, buddy. Uh, and uh, no response. Firefighters were called to lift the safe and remove the man's body. George says he didn't recognize who he was, but feels for his family who are now left wondering why. What's the chances that ever happened to anybody, you know? But like I say, he's got to have family that cared about him or somebody and to die like that. That's a bad way to die. Now, the man has been identified as 28-year-old Jeremiah Disney of Marion. As for the safe, George says there was nothing in it. In Studio 15, Ruben Solis, Wayne 15 News. Ruben.